Toxic Gamers, welcome back to Subnautica. Let's go check out if anything has hatched in our alien containment. <laughs> well, looky there! What do we have? We have a sand shark, uh, an ampule, I think that's called, and a rabbit ray. Cool, all things that I don't think I can make any use of. But the cool thing is, Look at this! We can swim around and say hello to the little sand shark and he won't chase us! Apparently, as soon as we put him out in the water, though, outside of our base, he will become aggressive. Or, or she, perhaps. Still don't know what these eggs are yet. Ooh, is that one, like, hatching? Is that why it looks weird? Or is it just underground? Maybe that's, maybe that's why. I feel like this is potentially one of those gas pod guys. It could be wrong, but we'll find out eventually. Nothing <laughs> that I can use yet. So I'm gonna drop these peepers in here that I happen to pick up and we'll let them breed. Hopefully we have enough room for them to breed more and, oops, that way we can have a, a, an endless supply of food. Oh no, is he dead already? Why is he spinning around like that? I also realized I haven't actually scanned any fish yet because I don't, don't feel like chasing after them in the water. So now I have scanned some of those guys. Okay, so we are loaded up on first aid kits, water, and food. Let's drop off our habitat builder. We don't really need that as soon as we leave our base and okay one battery hmm let's take a power cell charger or power cell battery and maybe just another regular one uh actually here how about we put oops let's replace this guy and, oh, no, 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 stop. And I will put the 66% one on the battery charger. And now that we have a fancy schmancy uh, container on our Seamoth, we can store these power cells and everything inside that. Oh, and why don't we fill up our bioreactor while we're at it? You know what? Maybe that's what I should do with the, the Predators because I don't want them taking up space in my alien containment center. Maybe I'll just turn them into energy. Because that seems like a very humane thing to do, doesn't it? Uh, okay. So today, I want to not only try out our awesome new Seamoth upgrades that we have, but I want to go looking for the floating islands, which I believe are to the north, and nighttime has arrived just in time for us to go venturing out, but hopefully by the time we get to any unknown territory, it will be daytime and won't be able to see any sort of unsafe thing approaching. Okay, I think those are probably just solar power fragments, so I'm not going to worry about those right now. Ooh, what do we got over here? Another mushroom forest. Cool. Let's see if there's... Oh, what was that? Okay, just some jelly rays. Not too concerned about them. See if there's anything worth checking out here. Doesn't seem too happening. Although it's hard to tell since it takes the textures a while to pop in. Yikes! It's like trying to fly the Millennial Falcon through an asteroid field. Ugh! Man, I really hope there's some optimization that happens with these graphics before release because I currently have everything on high settings, so there's no reason that this should be popping in like that. But what can you do? What do we have over here? 
I'm not sure what this is. Let's check it out. Is this anything? Oh, okay, it's an egg. Cool. Maybe it's a jelly ray or something. Ah! We'll find out. I'll pick up this lithium. Oh god, that's it! Ah, oh, that sounds like a reaper. Ah, where's my sea moth? Where'd it go? Oh no, where is it? That's not my current sea moth. Oh my gosh, you guys. Why am I so bad at this game? Ah! There's the light. Okay, there it is. Man. Don't want to lose our pink sea moth. Ah, <sighs> where is that reaper? I don't like the sounds of that. Ooh, what do we have here? This looks interesting. All right, there's a not so nice guy right there. Hopefully we can just jump out and scan this real quick. Ooh, Cyclops Bridge, that's cool. Much obliged. You never know what you're gonna find around these parts, I guess. Probably something we have here, but might as well check it out. Scanner room, don't know. Um, no. Okay, we did need that. Fantastic. Ooh, here's another one. Wow! The things we find on our adventures. Hooray! I believe the scanner room will eventually be for the Cyclops. Oh my gosh, I really don't like the sounds of that Reaper, if that is indeed what I'm hearing, but... Ah! Oh, no, okay, maybe it's that thing that I'm hearing. Ah! I still don't like it. Still not a fan. Oh, Jesus. Is it chasing me? Ah! Where'd he go? Okay. I don't know what kind of damage that guy does to me or my Seamoth. Don't feel like finding out. So there's that. Ooh, okay. So Tion told me that I should pick these guys up so that I can grow them in my place. So I will jump out here and grab this guy real quick. Let's just grab a couple of those. Oh, one of them was quartz. Okay, fine. There we go. And anything else I see? No, that just all looks like quartz and stuff, but that's okay. I am running a little low on quartz, so it's not a bad idea to pick it up when I see it, but I want to wait until a return trip in case I find other things that are of more use. Gonna kind of skim along the ground here and make sure I don't miss any more fragments since those actually seem to be useful. Okay. Is that another creature egg? Yeah. I'll stick with one for now because those are probably jelly rays and I can't really do much with them. Ooh, but I do want to grab some Reginalds. Oh, I don't know what those things are, but I'm gonna... Wait, no, these aren't Reginalds, are they? No, those are Cyclops fish. Okay, I don't I don't want to hang out here because I see, I see some guys there. They don't look super friendly to me. Anything that resembles a spider, I don't really want to mess with. So yeah, we'll kind of pop up to the surface a little bit here first. And keep crossing our fingers to run across these floating islands. Oh, I really don't like it when I can't see anything, guys. It's not the best thing ever. This is a little nerve-wracking once again. Do I want to go lower? I don't know! I do have a whole reinforcement, so that's good at least. Okay, we're changing colors now. Oh my gosh. 
Huh. This is really terrifying. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what to think about this. Do I dare go down? Oh god! Ah, the, the music changed. Why? Why music? Why do I have women singing to me all of a sudden? Oh my gosh. New music is never a good sign of- Oh god! Ah, okay. <laughs> Just that. No big deal. Okay. Rock music. That's rather intense. Um. Oh. Okay. My curiosity is getting the better of me right now. I may regret this, especially with this very intense soundtrack. Oh my gosh. The hell is that? Oh, good lord. Ah. Uh, you know what? I'm I'm aborting this mission. Nope, 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 nope. Not happy. Not happy. Where's my sea moth? There it is. Okay. Oh no! What is that thing? Ah! Uh, oh, please stay away! <laughs> well, help me! Lord Captain. Ah! I regret my decision. Don't look behind us. Never look behind. Huh? <gasps> chasing us? I don't know. Oh, there's- there's that thing. Those guys are- Ah, oh, yes, 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 sorry. Oh, hey, more frightening things. Yeesh. Okay. Well, no floating island this away. I think I can potentially add on another upgrade to my Seamoth that will allow me to go down to 400 meters. I think that's what Tian informed me, but I can't oh, remember sure. off the top of my head. Yeah, yeah, I know. Thank you very much. Okay. Oh, not- Oh, no, 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 no. I don't like the, the dark blue where I can't see anything. That's not- that's not too cool. Not cool game. Ooh, oh. Hello. Whoa, what is this? Are these our floating islands that we've been looking for? Ah, yes, and perhaps they are surrounded by reapers. No, just those things, whatever they are. I always thought that sound was a reaper. I don't know if I should be scared of those or not. So, I'm gonna go with being brave at the time being. What do we have in here? Oh, I recognize those guys from the Aurora. Yeah, I'm not scared of you. You don't even hurt me in human form. Buzz off. Ah! I don't like the other ones too well, though. Don't see much here. What's this? Ooh, is this... Diamond, perhaps? I can't remember if we really need more of this. I don't think we do. We've barely used the diamond that we have. Oh, yes, I know. I will leave in a second. Okay. So I'm out of food. I don't want to hang out too long. Erosion patterns on the landmass is suspended here suggest they once- Ah, what did it say? I wasn't watching. I'm sorry. Please tell me again, game. I don't imagine this is sandstone, but I'm gonna try anyway. Basalt. Meh. I have a whole island of basalt. Don't really care about that too much. Well, I was hoping for- Potentially some sort of fragments here. Don't really see much. 
I can't imagine I'm going to find too many new minerals or things like that at this point in the game. I could be wrong, but I think it's just going to be more of the same and potentially more creatures and fragments and that sort of stuff. But we have definitely approached a somewhat lava-y area. Okay. Back to the ship. Okay. That's not too exciting so far, but this is obviously the floating island area that we were looking for. So many angry things. Oh, hey, buddy! What what happens if I let you... Oh, you didn't even do any damage. Ha ha ha, sucker! Ah! And then there's the music again. No bueno. Come on, give me something new. I went through all this effort to find these cool floating islands. What? Leave me alone. You can't do shit to me. Now with my whole reinforcement. Oh, hey, there we go. There's something interesting. That's what we want. Too bad these... Oh, wow, that's a huge wreck. Too bad these angry guys are all around here, though. They don't hurt my ship, but I bet you they damn well hurt me. Hmm. I'm gonna look for an entrance here before I hop out of my sea moth. Foxy Fresh will keep us safe in the meantime. Yeah, rocking out. Leave me alone. Stop it. You guys are jerks. I definitely don't want to get out with you around here, though. Maybe this is what I'm supposed to get torpedoes for, huh? All right. In we go. As quick as possible. Oh, God! I don't want to die. Hurry up. Open door faster! Oh no, don't tell me we needed to bring our welder. What's this? Ah. Ooh, another plant pot. Oh, there's so many angry fish around here. Sounds like they're trying to get in. Let's go fast. Oh, oh, there it is. A bench. What the fuck? I don't want to waste my time with that crap. I want good stuff. Come on. Give me good stuff. Please don't be angry things on the other side of this door. Thank you. Hmm. Ah. Cut open. Why am I not carrying my laser cutter with me? I should know better than this by now. Ah. Uh... Oh, there we go. Stasis rifle. Ooh. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. That's cool. Da -da 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 -da. Okay. Probably should make our way back. Oh my gosh, leave me alone. Propulsion cannon. Oh, we already have that, huh? Emergency. Ten yeah. Of yeah, yeah, yeah. Ha! -ha! Aboard, Captain. You cannot get me! Ah ha ha Caution. 30 seconds of Ah ha! Fuck you! You're stuck now! I hope you die! Well, I guess I'm not going back in there. Ah! I am damaging my ship, though, by bumping into stuff. Okay. So, I want to leave a beacon here to tell myself this is where the ship is but I need to get these things off my trail real quick leave me alone you fuckers all right we good bros we good okay here we go 
drop you there. And floating island wreck. There may be more than one, but that's the only one I know exists right now. Okay, so we'll have to come back here with a laser cutter and note to self to always carry that around with me because I did not think about the possibility of encountering other wrecks where... Ooh, is this a Reginald? No. No, the Reginalds look like the Peepers, don't they? But yeah, I did not know to expect other wrecks to need laser cutters. Cool. Well, at least we can potentially build ourselves a propulsion cannon. Ah, don't run into the island. Good job. Hmm. Ooh, look, another creep forest. Ooh, maybe we can find silver here, huh? That would be freaking awesome. What do we have? Limestone. Grr. You know, I'm gonna change out our power source while we're here. Because that is just about dead. It would be really fantastic if we could find more silver over here. Ooh, please. Please let this be... Enough of a cave to be sandstone. Damn it! No! I want sandstone, you jerks! Come on! Not cool! Arg. Ooh, what are these? Eye stock, huh? Can I. Haja! Aw. Inventory full. Boo! Ooh, well this is cool. Ooh, there better be some sandstone in here. Although my inventory is full, isn't it? Damn it. Hmm. Well, we can drink a water for starters. Come on, purple brain thing. Give me some oxygen. Thank you very much. Ugh. Why is this all limestone? Sandstone, there we go. No, we don't want gold. Curse you. Yes. No. No! Screw it, I'll drop the blood oil. Because that was totally sil silver that we just dropped. Yeah. Yes. Give me the silver, all the silver! No! 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay, okay. We'll get the brain. Give me your brains! Brains help me breathe! Oh, man. I really wish I had another beacon right now. I thought about making one, but I didn't do it. Okay, let's remember. There's our base, and... Floating island wreck. Uh, okay. So it's between energy, or here, here we go. It is directly north of our base. Well, almost directly north. Okay. Gonna head back home and see what all we got. Pretty cool that that instantly charges up our power cell for us. I'm definitely a fan of that. Well, thankfully, because we found that awesome cave over there in the newly discovered kelp forest, we have a ton of silver now. So I will feel safe building a fabricator in this base so that we don't have to go back to the life pod every time we want to make something. And I might consider starting up a new base a ways away so that we can go exploring a little bit more and not have to worry about 
Um, getting getting back here. Ugh, geez, I'm kind of scared of the sand shark, even though I know it won't attack me. And not have to worry about getting back here to drop things off or pick up food. And I just think that'll be a lot more fun. Look at all these peepers that we got already. Two more. Okay. Ah, inventory full. No, I want the peeper, not the sand shark. Okay, make sure I'm going to leave at least two in here. There we go. Oh, this is so awesome. I'm not going to have to farm for food anymore. Fantastic. Alright, well, it was nice and fun growing the sand shark in here, but I'm going to... You know, I'm going to leave him because the ampule is pretty, but the sand shark and the rabbit rate... Oh, hey, look, there's a stalker. <laughs> well, since they don't drop me stalker teeth, um, we're just going to cook these guys. And by cook, I mean throw them in my bioreactor because I can't actually eat them. I know this is really terrible of me to do, but I don't care. Oh, except we can only put one in there for now. All right, fine. <laughs> that is so awesome, though, that I can just throw this stalker in there for energy. Okay, we'll put the sand shark back. He can live another day yet. And I'm also going to cut up these... Ah! Oh wait, I can't get out that way. That's right. Herp derp. I'm gonna cut down my creep vines over here and actually place them inside. Blood nutrient levels decreasing. Calorie intake Let's see. I think we'll do three... And we'll put those inside our alien containment so we can actually build some full-grown creep vines. Alright! We are moving things along, guys! Okay, I think that'll about do it for this episode. We discovered a, another new biome, if you can call it that, I suppose. But I will plan on going back there in the near future with our laser cutter this time and see if there's anything else in that wreck to explore. So thanks a lot for joining me, guys. And as always, please like if you enjoyed this video and subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, stay foxy, everyone.